the Galinsky brothers are bringing it to the table, sticking it in your face, and letting you be prepared for the next wave of real. I'm, I'm pals for, of the Galinsky brothers and fans of theirs from back in the day. I love those brothers. I can't tell you which one I love more. If, if you forced me to, I could, but I love them equally. <laughs> The Manhattan Monologue Slam exceeded my expectations. I was not expecting the performers to be so professional. Um, you know, they really, just from everything that you learn from good theater acting, they have in their monologues. And uh, they did a really good job, really great pieces. A lot of them write their own pieces, and they did a really nice job with the writing. So I was, I was impressed with the wealth of talent. I was actually quite surprised by the fact that a lot of these people wrote their monologues and how uh, talented they were in that respect. Um, it, it works very fast. Um, the, uh, the, the performances are, are, are varied, so, so you don't get sick of them. You, you don't know what to expect from one to the next, and uh, it has such a, such a great pace to it as well. I have to say it was really fun to be a judge because you got to like get your little two cents in there about what you thought about uh, all the different performances. And I think this is a great way to do it in a way that's exciting and fun and, um, and can really translate to a mass audience. So I think it's a fantastic idea for a TV show. It's just the mixture of the TV film world with theater and it's, it's an actor's dream really. When is reality TV going to give it back to the actor? This is the show that does it. It's creative, it's smart, it's fast paced, it's clever, it's provocative and it's thought provoking. It's necessary, it's needed, and it will work.